welcome back guys uh, I think we want more cars on these because they're running maxed out all the time and we've got loads of passengers waiting so should we start upgrading them uh, wherever the hell they are here we are <laughs> yeah I think uh, I think we upgrade them so now where's the freaky depot depots down here now the only problem is uh, Where's the, where's the damn train? The only problem with replacing these damn things... Oh, pause. Pause, pause, pause. Now, you... Uh, are you unloading? Uh, oh, no, you've just, you've just picked up. Damn it. Okay, well, maybe we can do the other one. Where's the where's the other one? You're there. Okay. So when he gets to here now, did you stop? No you didn't. Good. So the signals are working now, good. When he uh, when he gets to here, we'll let him unload, but we won't let him pick up. I mean, not that it makes a huge amount of difference, but, but I, do, I do like to try and not kill the passengers by blasting them into infinity. You know what, I should, I should like go, if I'm waiting for the train, I should kind of ride it, shouldn't I? This is the one we want to upgrade first anyway, because this is the old train. Okay, so, uh, ta, I was looking at the wrong train, idiot. Yeah, you know what? Forget the passengers. Just go to the depot. <laughs> Otherwise, we'll be here all day. Just go to the depot. Yeah. So those those thirty six passengers get blasted into infinity. I think they do. Do they get sent back to the platform or something? Maybe they get sent back to the platform because we've got 63 people waiting there. Either way. Either way, it's not the end of the universe. How are we doing? We're... We made 368. Yeah, uh, what did we spend? Where did we spend? Yeah, we didn't seem to spend a lot, but we only made 368. Okay, weird. Uh, pause. Let's upgrade this train. So, this we want to sell. And then buy. We'll buy a Borsig, of course. Buy. And we'll put an extra couple of cars on. I think an extra couple's enough. I think it is. So, one, two. Yeah, let's run eight cars. Now, I mean, we could have fought... I mean, this could easily pull, like, 12 cars. Like, no problem. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We're, we're running eight cars. Do, do I go up to ten? Is it going to be worth it on this? I don't know. It does, it does seem we've got quite a lot of passengers. All right. All right. We'll go to ten. Like, what the hell? Let's go crazy. So, we're putting you back onto line three and go for it. Now, which way are you going to go? Oh my god, he's going to go the right way. Unbelievable. Cool. So, how many passengers have we got waiting down here? What's your carrying capacity now? You can now carry 60 passengers. Do we have 60 passengers waiting? Answer, yes, we freaking do. Wow. Awesome sauce. With extra cool beans. So, yeah, I think in that case, we'll, uh, we'll get this one in as well. Uh, and get him upgraded. So how many passengers we got waiting here now? 86. 
but that's inflated because I think I think the passengers when I get kicked off the train maybe to the nearest station I don't know I, I honestly don't know alrighty right get yourself into this station quick come on because I've got other things to do I've got I've got blooming goods lines to look after you know so this isn't the only thing right hang on a second yeah right go to the depot right so, yeah, so you are so you're only running with 27 passengers up to there but I guess that's going to increase or I hope it will increase over time we'll see okay you're already in the depot so let's go and we'll upgrade this so by trains we've already got a borsig on this one so one two three four so that's four eight ten set you on line three go now i wonder if we'll be able to see the difference in wear and tear between the old and new it's kind of difficult because of the smoke to see like the roofs of the carriages but uh i don't know maybe that's that's that one we want this one don't we There's a, there's a bit of grime on these. Is the grime on the other ones? Yeah, there's grime on the other ones as well. So, on some of the other carriages, it's much easier to tell the wear and tear. You can see it very, very clearly. The rust and grime and dirt and all that kind of stuff. Alrighty. So you're running with 40 passengers. You're running with 27. And then, how are we doing here? 92, 93, oh my god, okay, yeah. We've got quite a lot of passengers there. So hopefully these will get up to running at capacity. How are you doing now? So you've just unloaded and you've picked up a full load of 60 passengers. Oh, perfect. Exactly 60 people were waiting. You know, I'm te you know, I'm really tempted to get this guy to wait for this train so that they're running perfectly apart. But they're not far off. They're not far off. So how many passengers are waiting now? 77. All right. So you're running with a full load. You're not running with a full load. Now, how's that affecting our profitability? We did 327 last year. Uh, we spent 700. So we made about half a million in 1870. We made 300,000, but yeah, so about 700,000 last year. Be interesting to see what we make this year. Okay. Now, I could consider putting anti-clockwise routes on here and this is all expanding so I probably need to think about expanding these in the future see that road really needs to go to there and that road should probably come into here but I don't really want to knock buildings down at the moment um, okay, so you're running at 60, you're running at 32. Should we go and look at something else for a bit? How are you doing over here? Ooh, look at this, we've got 148 grain stocked up to be hauled. Now let's have a look at this, because we could... I, I'm thinking we could probably put some more trucks on this uh, let's see let's see how quickly he gets up to speed yeah I don't think we'd want to put too many more trucks on there it's 
taken him a while to get up to full speed. Now, I mean, we could always put a second train on there. The thing is, if, if we put a second train, yeah, we'd be hauling all this down here, but then this wouldn't process it because it doesn't have enough demand. So we'd need to somehow um, put in another line to another town, which, I mean, we maybe could do. We could run a line maybe around here uh, into Spilsby. That would be one way of doing it. How's, um, how's our stone doing? Oh, we've got loads of stone to be shipped. How are you doing? Ooh. He's doing well. He's doing well. How are we doing down here? Oh, there's loads of stuff to be shipped. Oh, we need another ship down here, don't we? For sure. Okay, well, let's put another ship down here. So let's buy, yep, a Wilhelm, cha-ching, and set line, line eight. All right, so let's have a look at you. Oh, yeah, God, I love these boats. <laughs> Awesomeness. So you're just coming in to pick up a full load. Yeah, we got 94, 95 waiting. So yeah, easily we could get another boat on here. Now over here, how are we doing? We've only got the two carts running. Uh, no, we haven't. We got, no, we got, we got no, we've got six carts running. We've got three on each, haven't we? Yeah, one, two, three, one, two, three. And they're kind of, sort of, just keeping up at the moment. But I think if we, um, having doubled up the ships, we're going to need to double up the carts. Or, well, at least two more on each line. So, I think we should probably do that. Let's do that. Uh, now I've no idea which which lines which lines which. So here we go. Buy road vehicles, and we want. Uh, well, let's put the let's put the horse carts on, and that'll definitely speed things up. So one, two, and we want you to go onto line seven. There we go. And then we'll have two more. And you'll go on to line nine. Yeah, line nine. That's the orange line going down here. Alrighty. And these are the nice, sexy new flatbed trucks. Or carts. And they are staggeringly cool, aren't they? Yeah, yeah well, let's just ride alongside for a bit so we can have a proper look at them. They've got the shiny mud guards. There we go. Now, I'm I was just wondering, are we going to see them with um, actually a loader on the back? Oh, yes. Yes, that had stuff on the back, that one. Oh, 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 I want to see. I want to see one actually, like, load up. Oh, you're going back, aren't you? Slow down. I want to see you. Where Where are you? Which one are you? You're this one. Okay, let's ride along. Let's get rid of that. We can speed you up a little bit. But I actually want to see you load up. Here we go. He pulls in. And he's going to load up with a load of food. There we go. Looks like bricks. 
but apparently it's food. Oh no, it is bricks. It's no, this is of course this is construction materials. It is bricks. <laughs> oh my lord! Seriously, you must wonder, like, hey, like, how does he manage to like feed himself and like, <laughs> like, find his way to the bathroom and things? Oh, that is very cool. Oh, I want to see all kinds of stuff on the back of these. Then, what does food look like on the back of these? And what do tools look like? And all kinds. Of, they're probably just crates and things, aren't they? See these covered wagons. You, you can't see anything, but these flatbed ones. Are, oh, that is. Oh, that's made my day. That has made my day. Alrighty. So that's that. Um. Now, okay. I tell you what I was thinking of, right? We could massively expand this. I mean, we could put, we could double this up and have have two trains run, running up and down here. Um, the thing is, we need more demand for this. Otherwise, this won't produce enough. So what I was thinking was, we could have a boat delivering over to Ghoul. And that could be pretty cool. The problem is, um, these docks will only cope with a limited number of ships. Um, so, and I honestly don't think that it will cope with more than three at most. So we're going to have to put another docks in somehow. Now, this is going to be this is going to be tricky. Um, what I'm going to do, I'm going to run a small country road. Now, can I run it from there? No, of course I can't. Um, I'm running it on slow, so that's fine. Seriously, like, there's no way I can run it off. All right, well, what, like, can I run it off there? No, no, no apparently. What, 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 what about just like a little spur? No, construction not possible. What about a bit further down? No? Okay. What about if I run one off here? Ah. That's a kind of sorta. Alright, let's... Ah, there we go. Thank you. Okay. What we need to do is somehow run this down, I don't know, to about maybe there. And then put in a, a second docks. Now, God knows how we're going to squeeze this in. I don't even know if it's possible to squeeze this in. That's within range if I can get it to attach. Um, oh, try putting a freight one in, Bonehead. Oh, I bet you were screaming then. Oh, he's going to put the right one in. Oh, oh. My God, that will go in there. All right. You know, can we like, get a bit closer? So it looks like it actually looks like multiple docks. All right, cha ching. Right now, is it still within range? Oh come on! Oh, I seriously, I hate it when it does this, and it does do this sometimes. Right, that one's in range. That one, I checked it, it was said it was going to be in range, but when you actually hook it up, it's not in range. Oh, you son of a... Okay, so after repositioning this like four times, yes, four times I've put this in, right? I want to show you something, because this is kind of interesting. If I take out uh, this, road up, this road up here, right, now... This is attached to that, right? That's within its catchment area, okay? This one obviously isn't because it's not attached. Right, so let's let's attach this one. Okay, so now this one has got the, the that attached to its catchment area. Hooray! Except that now this one doesn't. So it looks like you can only have one dock. Um, attached directly to that which is really freaking annoying um, 
So, and it also means <laughs> that I'm going to knock this down again. Um, so what I'm going to do, um, I'm going to get rid of these roads, and I'm going to get rid of that dock, right? And then I'm going to smooth this out, and I'm going to put this in. But I guess this is the this is the learning process, and that's kind of cool. No, that's kind of cool. That's okay. I don't I don't mind going through a learning process. Uh, but like again, if I was running this on hard, I, I wouldn't be able to try these things out. And I've got a little tiny bit of road there that needs to go. There we go. And then I can finish smoothing this. Um, yeah, running on running on medium. I I couldn't try these things out. Whereas now, I'm running it on easy, I can, which is very cool. So, we're, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this dock, like, a distance away. Because there's no point having them very close together. Um, so, let's put you, I don't know, you can go. So, so, I'd really like to put them, like, really close together. Like, I don't know. But I, I kind of can't. No, I can't. Oh, you go there. Do I put you there? Nah, nah. I'm going to put it over here. So, <clears throat> you're going to go there. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to link these up with here. Do I do it like, I don't know, maybe. Maybe a road like that and a road like that. Uh, come on, come on, come on. Just. Go the way I want. Thank you. All right. That'll, that's close enough. Actually, I'll do it the other way. Mind you, this will go and go straight either. <laughs> Why won't you rope? Let's go straight, for heaven's sake. No, that'll do. That'll do. And then run. See? And again, trying to get it to go the way you want it to go. Ay, ay, ay. Come on, behave. Let's try, what about from there? What about if I put it to there? Will, will you, okay, that's the best it's gonna do. Yeah, fine, okay, whatever, whatever, I give up. Um, what, what was I gonna do? So what, so what I'm gonna do, obviously, is have some carts hauling down here. So you are, you're not in range, you're not in range, fine. So what we'll do is we'll put a, uh, freight thing up here. So I'll flip you, flip you around. So we'll put a freight thing up here. I mean, it. The, the, the thing is, this isn't going to be going like particularly far. <laughs> it's kind of ridiculous, almost. Um, and then I don't know. Oh, would you? Oh, would you connect to there? Oh, you would. Perfect. That'll do. All right, so then we want uh, we want a little depot. Uh, where are we going to put a depot? Would you would you go there? Yeah, you would. Too much curvature. Uh, what about if I flip you around? I'm I'm trying to create a, like a little docks kind of sort of area. But how about yeah, that'll do. All righty, so we're going to buy. Um, I don't think we're going to need too many. I don't know, three maybe? I would think. One, two, three. Uh, why don't I just buy like five? <laughs> uh, five might be too many. Let's. Uh, Alright, we'll run four. Okay, set up a line, new line, just from there to there. And that's it. Okay. Oh man. I just spent. How much did I spend doing that? Like 1.3 million. Jesus H. That's crazy. Okay, so now we'll see if this actually works. Like. Okay. So this is for line 12. So that'll come down here. And then, how's it going to get divided between these two? That's the thing. Okay, pause, because um, I need to change these lines anyway. So, because currently, we've got 
uh, that guy into that docks and I want it to come to this docks. So that's um, line four, isn't it? Yeah. So, no, it's not. No, it's not. It's line line eight. There we go. Let's get rid of line four. So line eight, we want to get rid of that stop and we want to add that one. So you're going to come into there and then go back to there. Cool. And then we're going to create a new line uh, out to here, uh, which should be probably just as much fun as the one that we've just done, I would think. <laughs> uh, you know, I'm, I'm going to get out of the habit of having them direct and I'm going to put blooming trucks because it just makes life a hell of a lot easier. Now, that's going to be a bridge across there. I'm pretty like 100% I'm like certain that's going to be a bridge. So, um, let's change it to a medium straight. Right, and then... Let's see, why won't you come off straight? Seriously. Thank you. Oh my God, that's the first thing that's gone straight. There we go. And... I'm seriously thinking about doing the same like over here. So let's run you out like there and bring you down there. So that, you know, encourage, encourage a bit of growth. And same, we'll run you up there, cool, and you across there. The thing is, if you don't do that, they'll, um, they'll grow out along these roads and then you won't be able to put those those things in I'm seriously tempted to knock that bloomin factory down 170k to knock that factory down but if we do we could that's that's if I'm not if I'm paying 170k I'm having a straight down road thank you finally so let's run that out like that oh man that's knocking two freaking buildings down Give me a break. That's two. Jeez. No. Oh, thank... All right. You know what? I'll settle for that, because at least it's only knocking one freaking building down. So, yeah. Knock that building down. Then let's run that out here. This road I'm going to change, because I don't like... I want to kind of grid it a bit more so we'll run you straight out like that and we can run you up like that and take you up there like that and we'll also run uh, oh yeah if I can do it without knocking that building down yeah there we go um, do I take it a bit further? Yeah, probably. All right. So we'll run that out like that. So, oh, come on, Rhodes. Will you behave, please? Thank you. So you're going to go out there, and we'll run this down there like that. There we go. All right. That's kind of sort of bearable-ish. Okay, so where am I going to have my docks? I'm going to have my docks uh, probably like down here. In fact, that's exactly where they're going. So let's spin you around. Now, a nice thing about this route is that the, the docks are all going to be oriented the right way for, for ships to come in the easiest way. So, yeah, let's put you there. That's fine. And then we'll have, I don't know, let's have a road going straight up there. Right, coming across here. All right. And then what do I want? I want to put in uh, one of these. Flip you around. Blop, blop, blop. And you go in there. And then I want another one. Uh, uh, try and get the right thing. Uh, now. Yeah, this is going to be the question. How do we get access to 
the commercial. Ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. okay. Well, we're gonna want one like up here, aren't we? Um, but man, that's okay. Well, we're we're up to we're kind of up almost up to the center. Um, geez, I like how can we get close to that? What about if I? If I flip it round and hook it up down there, how, like, how, wow, that's, that's not staggeringly close. Okay, I'll tell you what we'll do. Let's try taking out this bit of road here, all right, so that we can attach directly to that. That might get us a bit more coverage. Yes, there you go. That's the solution. So, we want that there. Right, so you cover up to there. And then, now we need to cover the rest. And I'm seriously thinking that if we're not going to be able to do this in one hit. We'll try. So, see, we're not getting that, that building right there. God damn you. That's as close as I can get. What about... No, that won't do it. What about over here? No, there's no way to get that. Oh, come on. You're kidding. Okay, well, um... Pfft. I mean, the only other thing I can do is actually knock some blooming houses down. Um, which, I don't know, maybe maybe that's the right thing to do. So, you know what, I'm just going to do it, what the hell. So, oh, come on. We'll just... One building. 334k. Holy bejesus. Uh, let's try this smaller one. That's like a mansion. Uh, let's try with a small street. How much is that? 156. Yeah, that'll do. Okay. So we'll put a truck station in. Flip you around. Right. And that gives us the coverage that we want. Cha-ching. Holy hell, God, this is um, a bit of a nightmare sometimes. Okay. So, yeah, we can go up there, up to there, and then back round here. So that's not too bad a route. And then subsequently, if we want to, we could put something in there to cover the industry. If we're shipping industrial stuff, put one up here to cover this. Area. Yeah, yeah, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. So I, I need a little depot, don't I? Yeah, I do. Um, let's put in a little depot, which, um, should we keep that down by the dock? Nah, nah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put it next to this, because I think it, I think it kind of looks good when you put it next to that. Um, let's try that again. Yeah. How about there? Yeah, that's fine. Okay, buy road vehicles. So, what do we want? We want horse carts. And I'm thinking, I don't know, one, two, three, four, I don't know. Should we set it up with like four? Yeah, all right. And we want new line, and it's going to go from here to there, to there, and that's it. Okay. Um, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. That, sh uh, that should work. That should work. God, I hope that's going to work. We'll see. Um, bum, 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 bum. Well, let's see. Let's see. So, there come our carts. All right. So, I just need to put this line in, don't I? Yeah. I think that's all I need to do. So, we want a new line which runs from this port to this one. And you'll see, look. It goes straight in, straight out at this end, and 
straight in, straight out at this end. And yet this does this silly thing at both ends. It's not really fair, is it? <laughs> like, going one way it works, going the other way it doesn't work. It's, it's weird. Um, okay. So now this is open for business. Oh, we, uh, we've got the Class 53 Prussian G3. Uh, we need to put a couple of boats on here. So let's buy a couple of these Wilhelms. Buy, buy. And you are going to go on line 14. Bingo. All righty. So there you go. Right, let's have, let's have a look at our uh, our profitability or lack thereof. My God, look at this! I spent two point two million screwing around with this, but um, we only lost one point seven, so we've made made about seven hundred thousand. Um, so yeah, well, I guess we're still roughly profitable. Yeah, we're still profitable this year. I spent uh, three seventy five. We're down three seventy five. I said like a hundred thousand profit. Okay, cool. Holy hell! Um, I, seriously, guys, I was tearing my freaking hair out with this, trying to get this to work, and it's just like, nah, not gonna do it. Now, are you actually gonna? Oh my god, we're actually getting construction materials shipped to here. Now, I'm just wondering. Yeah, they're they're keeping up with it, but this should start to increase its production now because it's got much much higher demand. Yeah, potential is up to 112. So we'll see. We'll see if that starts to really ramp up. Oh, it looks like it's going up now. But it's going to need more stone. Which means doubling up this line. Because we've got loads of stone up here. We're not shipping it. So yeah, the um, the next thing we're going to do is double up this line to get the stone down here. And if you want to see me do that, well, guess what? Yeah, you're coming back for the next episode. So there you go, guys. I will catch you for the next one. I hope you enjoyed this. A little bit frustrating sometimes, but generally still freaking awesome. Catch you for the next one. Peace out.